Hey guys, it's Matt from TheEndGamer.com. Today I'm going to show you guys a quick way to install a custom map into your Killing Floor game. First off, you want to start off by downloading a Killing Floor map from a website. It's going to end in a .rom. That's the file architecture that this game uses. What you're going to want to do is go to your Start menu, go to your computer, and generally people are going to install their, their games onto the local disk or C drive. In this case, I have mine installed on a separate drive. Go into that drive, and what you're going to want to look for is your Steam folder. Mine's located in my main. Once you're in Steam, you want to go to Steam Apps. Then click on Common. Then find your Killing Floor folder, and open that folder. And from there it's simple, you click on your maps folder. Once you're in your maps folder, you're going to see a bunch of other .rom files. Simply take the .rom file that you've downloaded and drop it into the directory. Some maps may also come with separate files, such as sounds. And you can see that they've made it really easy these folders are, lo are labeled so that you can find pretty much any file type that would be included with a map installation. After you've installed your map, simply go to Steam and launch Killing Floor. That's all for today. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Remember to check out TheInGamer.com for reviews, our news blog, tutorials, or even post on our forums. We look forward to seeing you guys.